Good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Good morning, good morning everyone. We are fixing to leave the truck stop up here, but I figured I'd show you guys a little bit. I cleaned my floor really, really good, I think. I cleaned my dashboard real good. Oh yeah, so I had me a shower last night, and uh, hey, I think we are in business right now. We're ready to go, so let's get out of here and have ourselves a great day. No matter what the DOT is going to throw at us, right? So, let's get going. Here we are, back on the big roads, yeah. And it is the perfect day for DOT to be out here and do inspections. Look at it. It's not raining. It's beautiful, nice sunshine. The perfect solution for a nice DOT inspection. Yeah, as you guys probably know already, it's uh, going to be released these videos a week from today. But I always, I'm always a week uh, behind. So, uh, so you guys probably will know already that a DOT blitz has been going on. But uh, hey, we're going to see what the day will bring us. I'm not really scared to go out here. Oh, it looks like there's a scale right there. Looks like they're pretty busy right now. But it's only on the uh, south side, it looks like. Let's see if they're doing all kinds of inspections in there. They're definitely open, that's for sure. But well, they got a, two trucks in the back there, it looks like. Nothing crazy. We got about four. I guess two DOT cars and oh that's that's four DOT cars that they got in there. They got four DOTs in that small scale there doing inspections so yeah, it's okay. We knew it was coming so I done so much work on my truck this year that uh, I feel pretty comfortable saying that I'll be okay. Although if they really want to pick on something, they can always find something, right? But I think I'll be alright. I think so. So let's get down the road further and uh, see what they will do to us and what the day will bring us. And hopefully we will have a blast day. Welcome to Detroit, Michigan and Windsor, Ontario. We are just about to... Uh, fix the ambassador bridge I know you guys watched uh, probably watched this uh, video where I crossed this uh, bridge here a couple of days ago actually on Sunday today is Tuesday but I come through here at night so it was uh, it was dark so you couldn't really see it right the water looks gorgeous today nice and green oh yeah here we are, just about to cross the border. The other side is the customs booth. I have to go talk to them and see if they'll let me into Canada today. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they will. I'm a Canadian citizen, right? So I should be able to come in, right? Crossing border, entering Ontario. Yes, hope so, anyways. Oh, it's gorgeous down there today. I love nice sunshine like this, being close by the water. That's just beautiful. Oh yeah. Anyways, we'll go see 
customs and then we'll see you on the other side. Here we are back in Ontario. Windsor scale or just uh, I guess north of Windsor that scale was closed at the moment but they were in there. They were in there. They had a bunch of trucks in there that were getting inspected and stuff but we got the lights were out so uh, we got to drive by lucky us today man like I said before we're not really worried about it but if we don't have to waste time in there the better for me it is right so let's continue on to Toronto and we'll see what kind of luck we will have for the rest of the day here we go guys I stopped in uh, London earlier London Ontario that is at the Fly and Jay and uh, had me a shower, had me a bite to eat. Well, first I went inside and had me a bite to eat, and then uh, I was gonna go to the other side and use the restroom. And uh, I saw, well, they got a salon in there. I didn't know they had a salon in there, so I said, well, let's go in there. I need a haircut. Gotta look good here for the next couple of days for the DOTs, you know. So I took my hat off and I figured I'd show you guys. Get me a good old haircut. Well, get me a haircut. Well, I have to take a shower, right? So, I mean, I don't like the hairs back in the, in the back of my neck. They're all the little short hairs tickling me everywhere, you know, or itching or whatever you want to call it. So, uh, man, grab me a shower and yeah. So now we're uh, about 73 kilometers away from Mississauga Terminal. We'll drop our trailer there. Probably about an hour drive over there, and we'll be we'll be in uh, Mississauga. We'll drop the trailer and go over to the flying hook over there. Probably fuel this thing up, and uh, we'll be ready there for tomorrow. I don't have a reload yet, but uh, hey, that's okay. We'll get one eventually. I know Wednesday and Thursdays is usually a kind of a little bit slow for getting loads, so so we'll have to see what we get. But tonight my buddy is coming down to Toronto as well. He drives for the same company, and he says he's going to uh, finally, finally, going to hold up to his promise. He promised me a long time ago. When I uh, when I made a YouTube video about the Facebook app, and you can find that video almost at the bottom of my uh, of my uh, YouTube channel, I made a I made a video about the Facebook app. If you were jailbroken on your I iPhone or iDevice or whatever, and uh, uh, he promised me if I got 5,000 views on that video, he was gonna buy me dinner. So. And that video is uh, almost hit uh, almost hit 14,000 views right now. So it's up to 13,800 and somewhat views. Uh, I watched. I was looking at it yesterday when he when he told me that he was going to come this way. And uh, so he says tonight uh, dinner is on him. Yes, a master steak. Here we come. Oh yeah, and I'm going to enjoy every minute of it too. I love talking to him. I talk to him almost every day. He's a good friend of mine. His name is Barry. And we will see. Maybe we will catch him on camera tonight. We don't know for sure, but we will see. He's a little bit camera shy, but we will see. Maybe he'll be up for it tonight. And he's a very interesting fellow. He can talk, I tell you, he can talk. And that is the guy that I was going to interview a long, long time ago up there in uh, Lloyd Minister, Alberta. And then he uh, chickened out. He's a little camera shy, like I said. So we will see if we get him on film today, but you never know, right? Main thing is I'm getting my free, uh, free steak tonight. That's important. So... Uh, We'll get over there as soon as we can and we'll be ready for him. Alrighty guys, we are finished for today. 
and my buddy is parked right ahead of me there but uh, we didn't do any videoing as I suspected that we wouldn't be doing but uh, we did go to master steak and we had ourselves a good vi uh, good uh, steak up there and good talk and I hadn't actually seen this guy in probably in two three months but uh, yeah anyways we had a good time together and uh, so now we are finito for today so we'll go to bed here pretty soon and uh, hope to see you guys again tomorrow <laughs>